Hey what's up guys this is Shivam and today i have a very important news for those who eagerly waiting for uncover jailbreak for iOS 13.3 on newer devices like iPhone 11 series and iPhone 10s series and XR series which is using A13 and A12 processor and also this jailbreak including older devices like iPhone 10 and below which is having A11 to A9 processor probably uh, going to support in future but these devices already can be jailbroken via checkrun app but upcoming uncover jailbreak main focus will be on newer devices if you want to jailbreak your device to semi untethered means no computer required that means you can jailbreak from your mobile itself since checkrun is tethered jailbreak means every single time you jailbreak you need computer to jailbreak your device if you are on 13.3.1 and above you can't jailbreak cause this version is patched by apple so downgrade to ios 13.3 before it's unsigned also if you are on below version like me on ios 13.2.2 any ios 13.3 below version immediately upgrade to ios 13.3 before it's unsigned by apple once apple stop sign ios 13.3 you no longer able to restore ios 13.3 pound to own who's genius behind this uncover jailbreak community seems like he targeted only ios 13.3 let me show you his recent tweaks 3 days back pound to own posted that if you are on ios 13.3.1 you still have a chance to downgrade to iOS 13.3 if you are on iOS 13.0 13.2.3 you can update to iOS 13.3 if you are already jailbroken and save blobs and consider staying on the current version for now then he posted to be clear uncover will be updated for all devices on iOS 13.0 to 13.3 for those interested in semi untethered but A12 and A13 will be uh, priority then one day back Uh, he posted that it looks like the kernel expert will need some work to adapt it for each devices uh, if you are on iOS 13.0 13.2.3 update to iOS 13.3 asap and then he posted successfully added iPhone 11 Pro Max iOS 13.3 support to exploit i can work i can now work on updating the jailbreak itself hashtag #uncover then he tweeted kernel exploit required me to individually inspect each device on each version so it might not be practically possible for me to support all versions that's why you should upgrade to iOS 13.3 immediately if you are on lower iOS 13 version then after few hours later he tweeted that this is basically the biggest part of the jailbreak on iOS 12 and iOS 13 and later he posted that successfully bypass apple's new mitigations against my code sign bypass on my iPhone 11 Pro Max running iOS 13.3 then later on he posted iOS 13.2.2 won't be supported on initial release if ever everyone should just get iOS 13.3 as up then he posted iOS 13.3 is still being signed and you still have a chance to downgrade or upgrade to it for the upcoming uncover jailbreak and then um, he posted successfully installed cd on a13 i will now update my substitution support package to get tweak running so that basically it guys he already has installed cd install on a12 and a13 devices and uh, it's almost uh, going to release in officially so wait for that So my next method I'm going to be showing how to downgrade or upgrade to iOS 13.3 uh by using this method just follow my method and uh, you we are good to go uh, go to ipsw.me website and uh, search for your particular device uh, ipsw um and for me I'm using iPhone SE so uh, I'm going to uh, select iOS 13.3 for my iPhone SE I'm running on uh 13.2.2 so as soon as you see this green signal over there you just go ahead and download so right now it's signed so you should downgrade uh, downgrade as soon as possible uh when you whenever you see unsign ipsw that means you are no longer able to download this uh, ipsw download it as soon as possible i'm taking for my iphone sc and make sure you uh, select proper identifier for me iphone 5-4 for my iphone sc um, you see this blue button you can download it um, it depends on the mobile um, for me it's 3.43 gb also downloading for my iphone uh, 7 plus both of them are running on ios 13.2 i'm going to show you how to upgrade it so I'll, i'll come back once it is download okay the ipsw file has been downloaded just go ahead and connect uh, mobile i'm going to connect mine you can see the ipsw has been downloaded go ahead and collect it and drag it on the desktop 
so that we can easily identify where it where we kept that file okay now we are ready uh, connect we are connected to the computer you can see here you see id number and identifier number here and uh, you have an update option make sure you take a backup before you do this and for windows you can uh, type a shift command and update and for macbook i'm using option key and update just go ahead and update select your file and simply say update then it will extract the files to the computer sorry the mobile and it will take some time to do that i'm, go I'm gonna skip it and uh, if it is asking the password go ahead and provide the password to access the mobile i'm going to speed up my process so that it will uh, you, you will not get bored as you can see the um, it has been extracted and it started downloading on the mobile so i made it like 20x uh, so faster times so that uh, uh, i can show you immediately without wasting your time now it's uh, extracted and it has been updated our device now we are running on ios 13.3 as you can see it doesn't flash my anything all the data is there on the mobile i can see i'm running on is 13.3 and basically we are upgraded upgraded to 13.3 and it's the same method for downgrade and the same method for upgrading your device so very soon within a one or two days we will get our uncover so stay tuned for that so thank you for watching this is shivam signing off and it's always peace